Well, why don't you read through? Here, re read this, read this. Right here, right here, Nick. Our panel aims. Okay. Got it? Oh, are you taking a video? Yes. <laughs> Could you say your name? Jesse Miller. So why are you here? Why am I here? Because Ping told me it was cool and I'm a new student. I had absolutely no idea what it was. Nick, what do you think of this concept? I think it's true. You gotta hold on to culture, but you also have to let let your culture, you know, uh, evolve. This is awesome, especially since I've known so many undocumented immigrants from Mexico. How do you know them? I'm from Chicago. <laughs> okay. In what uh, situation do you know them? Um, my best friend's stepdad was undocumented. He's actually in jail right now because I finally caught him after 20 years. What has he been doing? What do you mean? In Chicago? For oh, 20 years? I mean, living with the, their family. Her mom, family. Could he work? Yeah, he worked. Yeah? He worked at a grocery store. So what did they do to him when they caught him? Well, they caught him because um, something about getting into a car accident, and he tried to run away from the scene, but they caught him. Um, because obviously he didn't want to, you know. Um, but he's from El Salvador. and So they send them back? They send him no, back? No, he's in jail waiting trial, because that's what they do. Do you, know, do you know all these uh, immigration detention center is all run by private uh, corporate? corporate profit, yep. They make tons of money. I actually, uh, at the U, I took a class on Latino immigration. Right. Because um, I've seen it play out in my own life mm -hmm. and whatnot. So, so what do you think of uh, this dollar bill? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't read this word. That's so funny. Can you read Spanish? No, not really. Could you tell me what it says? Uh, okay, so the question is, why is this here in an obscure location? <laughs> and it says, so Don Dinero is like, Don is kind of like a respective term for someone with like a lot of money. He's like the big boss. So it's right. like Mr. Money is the only, like, That's great is the only uh, worry of like this guy. Um, so he doesn't have interest in your education, but I didn't read the last part of that. Mm -hmm. But he, <laughs> but he, um, he wants to conserve the public image of McAllister in the eyes of the rich. What a disgrace. <laughs> and then it says, que desgracia, uh, blah, 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 que desgracia. So, that's so funny. Yeah. Do you know that I'm also an immigrant? I do. I'm still from China. I'm still a Correct. Chinese citizen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're not a citizenship here? No. Really? Mm -mm. If I, you were to get your citizenship here, would they make you get rid of your citizenship in China? Yes. That's, that's why. That's why I can't do it. Mm -hmm. I still no. can't sever my roots to China. <laughs> I had a, a professor at the U. Well, I guess she technically wasn't a professor yet, but she was my professor. Mm -hmm. Um. She had to give up her Mexican citizenship in order to become a U.S. citizen. Yeah. And she said it was like the happiest and saddest feeling ever. Yeah. Do you know why I'm so excited about this walk? Why? Because I came from Beijing University, which is the cradle of revolution and democracy. And uh, I went there from 1980 to 84. And I experienced uh, a lot. We call we, we at that time, we built like the wall of Amer uh, democracy, Ming mm -hmm. Chang. So this really reminds me of those years. And I'm just so proud of McAllister students having this courage and imagination and uh, tenacity to do this wall. I feel that's one of the reasons I'm still at McAllister, <laughs> working was these yeah. great people and this is hope. the hope of America. I just hope that it was actually like 
mostly undocumented immigrants and immigrants in general that were able to contribute to this wall. Uh -huh. You know? Right. Hey, Mom. I had no idea what Mong was before I came here. Yeah? There, I mean, there's a lot of Asians in Chicago, but it's mostly